Daikoku Futo, the largest toll road parking area located between the sprawling masses of Yokohama's Bay Bridge, which is also known as the Wangan Line. It's a massive space within the spiraling network of loop bridges where local and foreign resident car enthusiasts and racers gather to talk and meet new people. So I'm here at Daikoku Futo again. I brought my um, Lancer Evolution 5. We're just here, it's just a Thursday. I made friends with this owner of a Lancer Evolution 3 and I always wanted a Lancer Evolution 3 to complete my collection. This is one of the nicest and most clean looking Evolution 3s that I've seen in quite a while. In fact, you don't really see many of these these days. So we've got a first generation Evo 3 and a second generation um, My Evo 5 in the port. And it just so happens today that there's a huge collection of, of Evo owners. Most of them are 789 CT9A. And I, I made friends with the, uh, the the head of the group. And just, just look at this, it's got, I don't know, like 20 cars here. It's just, it's fantastic. I've got all kinds of varieties, normal looking cars with that. Uh, some of the really nice body kits. This guy with the Voltex wing around here. <laughs> the guy that I talked to earlier, this is his car, it's a 7. And this is matte black, I believe. Uh, really, really, really nice too. We have, I believe this 8. This is a 9 actually, it's got the, it's got the aluminium roof. And this is an 8, I believe. This is what it's like um, on the weekdays. Other than the Fridays that we are usually here, it's a time because there's not many people. So cars, uh, car owners of the same group, they come and gather, and they can have like bigger numbers, uh, and they just sit here, chill out, and talk. And this is this is the car life that's in, in Japan. But we're just going to talk to a couple of these guys. This guy came from yes. Kyoto all the way here. あの、<笑> すごい。<笑><笑><笑> エボ。<笑><笑> パワーがある。走りたい。走りたい。ああ。4 その時19だったんでお金なかったんでエボで行かなくて。ああ。何の理由ですか? <笑>
、うん、すぐ出ない<笑>あの陶芸とか走りますか知りますか知ってました<笑>住んでるの京都ですけど、はい、あの兵庫県まで走りに行ってましたおお<笑><笑>すごい<笑><笑>ありがとうございましたありがとうございます,います So that was just a little chat with some of the、uh, young and very enthusiastic owners. So let's go talk to、um, the Evil Free owner. Hey, how's it going? How are you doing? Good, good. What's your name? Roberto. Roberto, so where are you from?、Uh, well, I'm from Florida, United States, born in, in Venezuela. So I've been、uh, traveling quite a bit now in Japan. Right, right. How long have you been in Japan? Four years. Four years? Yeah. Are you liking it? Oh, I love it every day. Okay. Cool. So in Florida, you don't see lots of these fishes. Maybe you guys have any e e Yeah, a little bit of that. The newer, the newer models. Right, right, right. So what made you buy this three?、Uh, well, I always wanted to get into cars, but I know once you get into them, you end up dropping a lot of money into them. So、right. uh, I just tried the Evo one day, and the all wheel drive is what, what sold it. Nice. nice, nice. Hey, you said you had a four before. Yes. Why did you switch to a three?、Uh, just for the, the import stuff, the 25 year rule. Ah, right. So you're planning、yeah. to take it back to the US? Yeah, I, I want to take the Evo back. Nice.、So. Nice, nice. It, it's going to be so rare. Yeah. It's going to be so rare that it's going to be really, really rare.、Sure. You're going to be so special. Yeah, yeah. Definitely take care of it. Cool. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. Nice seeing you. Okay. The Lancer Evolution 3 is perhaps more iconic for appearing in Initial D, driven by Team Emperor Sudo Kyoichi, especially in this black color. It is, however, much more than that. As the first generation Lancer Group A base competition car homologated for the WRC in 1992, the Evo 3 is the last of these series before the Evo 4. It is also the lightest of the Lancer Evos and is the smallest at 1,250 kg and a factory output of 270 PS. It is perhaps the fastest accelerating of all. Roberto's car is well kept and a clean example of a real enthusiast. Most of these Lancer Evolution CT owners are guys and girls in their 20s. Finding inspiration and passion for all the JDM sports cars from popular media, games, or perhaps the older generation. Regardless, their gathering enforces the spirit of their chosen car, along with the legacy of the Japanese car culture. Most Japanese are friendly and respectful of each other's styles and interests, and this is what makes Daikoku so fascinating. Living here as a car enthusiast is the fulfillment of the ultimate path of excitement and passion. Now, being part of the culture, we will be looking deeper into the connection between the old and the new. So, on to the next parking, running the highways of the Wanga. See you next episode.